Temple Number 82 Nagori G Temple has a very interesting history. There is a folk legend that tells of a terrible ox demon who ate local people and their livestock. A skilled archer, entrusted with the task of stopping the monster, did so with three arrows. He brought the ox demon's horns to this temple, and a ceremony was held to enshrine his soul. A statue of the demon stands as a charm to ward off other demons. Kobadashi established the temple between 1810 to 8 between 810 to 824. We haven't even started today's hike and I'm going to be exhausted to sing the temple. Nagoriji Temple rests in the middle of a steep slope inside a grove of trees. It was positioned this way in the middle of a strenuous mountain path. I hate that word strenuous because it makes me nervous. Because Buddhism came to value ascetic practices in order to attain special powers that give one the ability to cast spells and make prayers come true. That's why the temple was selected in the depth of the mountains away from town and people for ascetics. The statue of Godai represents the five elements of earth, water, fire, wind, and void. And it is supposed to be one of the items Kobodashi used to establish the temple. Real Ohenro pilgrims buy books and they have them stamped, a page is stamped at every temple they go to. Nice stamps.